Hello everybody and welcome back to the Excessive Gaming Channel and Farm Simulator 2017. This is our Let's Play series here on Estancia Lapatio and today we are up to episode number 50. So if you could quickly drop us a like it would be much appreciated. And of course if you are new to the channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button as well. So episode number 50, what are we doing today? Well today is the end of this series, series number 6 which uh, I'm sure uh, many of you may say is a shame but all thing, all good things have to come to an end just uh, standing here looking at the uh, Lapaccio tree get uh, some good uh, views of that before we finish today we have slowed the game time right down so we can try and fit in as many jobs as possible today now what we're going to do, if you remember from the last episode we was doing the uh, sugarcane harvesting on field number uh, 14 I believe the number is we had everything over there working away uh, we did take about 70,000 or so litres to the train and that is still sat uh, ready to be loaded onto the train to take up to the transport company so we've still got all that to get harvested and finished today which we're going to only do some of it, we're not going to do too much but what we are going to do is also sell off a lot of the grain today that we have in storage so what are we going to do and how are we going to do it so we've got the Star ST Max and the uh, Harvester there we've <coughs> got the case with the high tip trailer and the uh, Brantner trailer attached to the Harvester at the moment but as you can tell it, they are not big enough to do the job that we need so what we've got and done yeah you can see it we've gone down to the store and we've leased the man uh, truck lorry the this is the TGS 18.480 uh, in nice bright red colour and of course the uh, cramp uh, bandit trailer nice big uh, uh, tipping trailer of course so that's going to give us a bit more stuff to do so what we're going to do is jump into there we're going to get that started up get the uh, cover opened up yeah we're going to take this to the field we're going to set up the uh, star at ST Max leave that running jump out there to uh, do the harvesting and we'll drive alongside in the uh, man TGS oh, I'm thinking why isn't he going it's because uh, he's not got a trailer there there we go Hopefully, it's not going to be able to reach it. Can we reach that or not? Looks like you can. Come on. So what's happening there? Why isn't he working? Unfold the tool. Did it put it unfolded? There we go, we got it in the end. Some slight glitch there for something not working, looking at that. So yeah, like I said, this today is episode number 50. Whoops. Today is episode number 50. We are, of 
course at the end of this series. And what we're going to do, like I say, is get everything uh, sold off and uh, cut, bring the uh, this series to a close. We have, of course, now closed the vote uh, on the uh, episode 30 for the next map. If, of course, you uh, do cast your vote now, it just won't be counted. So bear that in mind. But, uh, yeah, we've got all the results in. We are leaving those to be counted up. to be counted up and uh, when we come back with the new series it will be all sorted out and we should have everything sort of set up ready to go we are going to start the series off uh, with the uh, equipment etc and already stuff already purchased uh, various animals etc because it uh, opens up the series a bit and saves all the uh, hard slog from the start. If of course that's something that you think we shouldn't do, let us know in the comment section. But it must be in today's video. So that we can uh, obviously not do that. Yeah, like we say, today, episode 50, it is the last episode. And we are going to uh, bring the farm to a close today. So what we thought was we're going to do roughly sort of... Uh, 10 minutes of sugarcane harvesting. We don't want to do uh, too much of the same thing in one episode, especially when we've got an awful lot to do. So we thought 10 minutes or so just doing uh, some sugarcane harvesting. Probably fill this trailer once. <coughs> and then uh, we can move on to loading up other grains, etc. Getting those sold as well. So it's going to be a bit of a truck driving day for us. We are considering uh, leaving this series open. And maybe returning at some point in the future. With some additional videos, but uh, at the moment... This is uh, definitely going to be the last episode so far. So, you may uh, be able to hear my voice is slightly better still uh, under recovery at the moment after Wednesday's uh, performance we are of course recording this uh, Thursday evening ready for uh, publishing on Friday so yeah my mouth is uh, still recovering I'd say after Wednesday's performance but uh, for everybody that's sort of interested on that ground, it's uh, everything went smoothly, and 
we should now be up to uh, scratch very soon and hopefully after the weekend but uh, yeah if you want to drop any comments regarding that let us know again the comment section's there for you and uh, don't forget to uh, head on over to our Facebook page as well we are uh, got lots of uh, scope on there for you to send messages etc and make comments on videos and things like that so yeah head on over to our Facebook page at excessive gaming channel a link is in the description if you can't find it and talking down in the description there's uh, quite a few ways that you can support this channel through uh, simple things like our banner attic uh, you can earn yourself some free games etc just by doing some sponsored tasks it's completely free for everybody but uh, if you follow the link down below it of course supports this channel as well but and then it goes out to things like uh, notifications on our uh, mixer channel when we go live on mixer to when we do uh, our twitch streams and things like that and there is of course the uh, possibility to make donations to the channel as well if that's something you're interested in again the link is down below in the description be too far over here Looks like it, there we go. So the trailer's filling up nicely, that's uh, what, 20,000 litres of sugar cane in there. Like I said, I think we'll do one load of sugar canes and then we can move on to other bits and pieces. Of course, we're not going to be able to harvest the whole field today. Is like I say, I think we'll leave the uh, series open for uh, scope to come back and just finish off the sugar canes at some point. But you certainly get plenty of sugar canes off these fields. One lot of uh, uh, planting, so in the field, is enough to grow three lots of crops. And of course, you can either purchase more sugar canes from the store, or you can We can actually use the actual sugar canes that we are harvesting here. You can tip these into your storage sheds. And then just scoop them into the planter afterwards. But like I say, th these fields that we planted up are good for three lots of crops. We've obviously only had one lot of crops so far. So we will be uh, probably coming back to another harvest of the sugar canes at some point in the future. Again, look out on our uh, Facebook page for that. And you'll be able to get notified when we release those kind of videos. <coughs> well, like we say, moving into the next series, series number seven. We are going to take a short break whilst we get some bits and pieces set up with that farm. And then when we come back 
it's only going to be, I think, maybe a week up the outside of getting set up with that farm. It just gives us time to uh, explore the maps and play the game a bit. Get a few jobs set up, things set up ready for farming. And then uh, when we come back we can uh, start the Let's Play series together. So we're filling up nicely, we're at 50% or so, yeah, just about 50% of the trailer is full. making some reasonably good progress today it's actually took uh, a lot longer than uh, anticipated to get this trailer full so I think what we're going to do is we're going to jump cut now because obviously you've seen the process what we're doing and uh, what we're using and then once this trailer's full we'll come back and uh, we'll go off to the uh, loading point, tipping point and uh, get it all unloaded of course so we'll see you in just a tick whoops, press the right button there let's finish off this row, there we go so we'll see you in a tick ok, so welcome back <coughs> As you can see, the uh, trailer is now now nearly full. Spit our words out, blimey! And uh, we've still not got uh, too much of the field done. The, the uh, amount that we're getting from this field is huge. Like I say, it's going to be what one more row, I should think, and. Uh, we should of course be uh, nearly finished, I don't know what these two bits are here, it won't uh, harvest those and it won't actually uh, destroy them if we drive over them so I'm not entirely sure what they are, I think they might be glitched in there Like I say, one more row now, and I should think we will be finished with the sugar canes. I think, uh, like I said, we'll come back with a bonus episode for those. Yeah, we spent, uh, what, 21,000, I think it was, 21,000 pounds on this... Uh, truck and trailer for the lease, obviously it's going to count for the amount of usage we uh, use it as well there we go look, <clears throat> so 59,000 litres he's uh, not obviously going to work until until uh, another trailer comes back so in fact what we'll do is we'll just stop him there get around there, there we go Otherwise he'll just be charging us all that time. I think he's in here somewhere. There he is. So there we go. Dismiss the worker there. In fact, I think we need to switch it off as well. There we go. His engine switched off. So we'll leave him in there. We can hire a worker. Uh, another time when we come back. But uh, 59,000 litres of sugar cane <coughs> going up to the train station. 
I say the train station, it's the uh, green elevator. But our train is there, so. The good thing about the lorry is it's nice and quick. course do is park the back up into this section here hit that unload button and all that will uh, fall out it is counting as going in it's just uh, a bit awkward to uh, back it round and uh, get it all lined up plus I think the actual drop trigger is further out as well so that should be that finished. There we go. That's that uh, all done. So we'll shut that off there for a moment. We're going to jump into the train and we're going to load up those sugar canes now. Like I said, we've got the first tank over. Got 143,650 litres of sugar cane. That's all going to go into the train and now pull it forward a bit yeah I believe it goes into that second carriage as well This is automatically opened up that uh, third carriage. So all you're going to do is just rock the train perhaps and forwards, just try and get an even uh, layer of sugarcane on. About 143,000 litres. It's certainly going to take some time to fill up. As you can see, it's still filling there. So there's 120,000 litres of sugar cane we've got uh, in that first carriage there. So we've got two more carriages. So what we're going to have a little do, little little do. <laughs> what we're going to do is have a little look at what uh, grains we've got on the best prices. So we're heading off to the transport company and the best money products are the soya beans at £4,000, £4,163 per thousand litres and the rapeseed. So we're going to load both of those up onto the uh, wagon here. So we'll start that up. I think I've left the train running actually. Never mind. It should be alright. I do believe if you're away from a vehicle for too long it does actually shut it off for you anyway. Whoa! Nearly killed ourselves there. Not good. But uh, yeah. So we said... Rapeseed and soybeans are the two best products to really sell. I think you can only take a total of three products in uh, three grain products that is to uh, uh, one on one train load. So we'll do that, and then of course we can drive the rest of the grains to uh, a different sell point. So we don't want to keep using the train. So under the auger, we said uh, soybeans. I believe it was soybeans. Best double check. Soybeans four thousand one hundred sixty-three. So soybeans. Start filling it up. We've not got a great deal. 
of soybeans in here. I thought we might have had a bit more. Unless, uh, no, I think we had a great demand for soybeans and we uh, got them all cashed in through the series. If I recall. Of course, we still got all this sugar cane here as well to get uh, get done. But like I say, towards now we're at the end of the series. It's just about getting all the money in because all the money that we bring from this series is going to be transferred over to uh, the new series so that we can purchase uh, any equipment that we would like. Yeah, back here at the uh, grain elevator. So I'll we'll offload that there. Okay, we'll leave that running for just a moment because we're going to be going back. Jump into the train, yeah it did uh, definitely shut itself off. So we're going to pull that along to there. Load up the soybeans. See those going in. Like so. And then we can pull forward to the final carriage. I uh, don't think we've got anything else in storage. I've oh, still got some more sugar canes here. But uh, you know, the price on sugar cane is not the best. It is the best actually, but uh, not a brilliant price in total. But uh, yeah, these uh, rapeseed is uh, a relatively good price and we've got quite a bit of that so we'll go and uh, collect that up this lorry don't half move though it's uh, Nice and quick, 51 miles an hour. Certainly gets you about the map a bit quicker. Here we are once again. Like I said, we get that uh, canola or rapeseed or OSR, whatever you would like to call it. We get all that loaded up. And there we go, 49,650 litres of the rapeseed OSR. Whoops, 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 whoops. Ooh. Nearly tipped it over. That would have been a disaster. Spilling an entire load of uh, rapeseed all over to the uh, 
Sugar canes, yeah, would have been a disaster. But here we are, back once again. that there and uh, then we can get it all sold of course so now that that's emptied we'll park up here Don't want to get in the way of our other farmers that are using the uh, green dump as well. Green elevator. Jump. Oh, okay, when I said jump onto the train, I didn't quite mean that, but there we go. So there we go. We're going to put all that canola in the very back as well. Started up, and then you just pull that forward a bit. So, yeah, it's three uh, main product types you can put onto the train, plus, you can also put the logs on the very back as well if that's what your thing is. But uh, yeah, let's head on up to the uh, up to the transport company. Again, gives us an opportunity to uh, explore some of the map past the uh, BGA that we didn't use. Who was uh, considering it? Again, something we didn't quite get around to using in, in, within the series. Again, there's only so many uh, bits and pieces you can do with the funds that you have. But not to worry. So, I'm going to slow it right down a bit quick because this is the station. Slow. Slow. There we go. So, we've stopped there. This is where we're going to see 120,000 litres of sugarcane now sold. If you look at the money in the top right hand corner. We have £1,299,307 at present. Let's see how quickly this goes up. Yeah, it's flying up as expected it would. And there's that gone. £48,000 just over for the sugar cane there. Again, not a great deal, but. Uh, it, uh, the price of it wasn't brilliant. So pull the uh, soybeans forward. We've only got 23,000 litres of that. Let's see how much we get for that one. See, that made £97,000, which is considerably more than the sugar cane. And there was, what, 100,000 litres less? thereabouts. So next up is the uh, canola, rapeseed, oilseed rape. We'll sell that. That's making the money fly around as well. 
and £99,000 for that one. So the soybeans, yeah, we made a small fortune on. So what we're going to do is head on back around. That's the uh, pigs down there, I believe. Yeah, we'll head back round to the uh, uh, grain elevator, part this up, and jump back into the truck. I believe that's the uh, sawmill just there. the uh, little hospital type bit I believe it is another green elevator just up here yeah. it's a, always a good way of getting around a map exploring the map using the train you can zoom right out quite a bit and gives you the opportunity to look around. There's the uh, store just there. That, uh, lovely view of that bridge up ahead. Over the railway crossing. And there is the town just up ahead as well. Which I do believe we will be visiting today. According to the uh, prices. I think there is a sell point in there that we need to head to. We should be able to explore that again very soon. I think we did explore it in our map tour. But here is the uh, another grain elevator in the actual train station. Got to honk the horn as we go through. Just has to be done. Uh, just on the left there is a uh, is the harbour. And here we have another crane lift for wood. Again, if you're doing forestry in this area, you could uh, load up the train there. Over the crossing. Uh, just down on the left there, I believe, is the... Uh, uh, the sugar mill, the refinery. Here we are back at the uh, animal uh, animal market. So we'll start slowing that down. Come to a stop there, hopefully. Shut that off jump out and we'll jump back into the uh, man TGS start that back up and off we go so next up we are going to just sell some more products and then we shall draw the series to a close like I said, it's uh, going to be quite a long video today, but I think the last one of uh, a series does need to be that bit longer. But uh, hopefully you are enjoying today's video. If you are, remember to drop us a like, and don't forget to uh, hit that subscribe button if you are new, of course. Here we are back at the yard. Let's have a look at the prices board before we get started. Wheat, we've got 81,000 litres. And the best price is the uh, transport company again. But we are going to go somewhere different this time. We'll take it down. In fact, we'll take the wheat to the bakery. It's at £969. It's the lesser of the prices. But uh, it'll give us a chance to explore there. 
Although barley, we'll take the barley first, I think, to the bakery. Uh, so let's have that barley. That's a better price, and then we'll take the wheat to the harbour. I think it is the uh, best bet. We want the best prices for the crops where we can. In the same way as you would the train, just rock it backwards and forwards, just to uh, level it out. Put the cover on this time and uh, take it steady around that ramp. Out onto the main road, turn left. Like I said, we're going to take this off to the bakery. Go a lot quicker than the traffic does. Again, gives you the opportunity to uh, explore the map. But we're on uh, what 1.5 million now. Some money starting to come in. Still got those uh, pallets there that we need to get picked up at some point. Took back to the farm. Yeah, the bakeries into the in the actual main town. I'm gonna to put the little mini map on so uh, I don't miss it. I believe it's one of the first uh, tip points, if I recall. Yeah. So just as you go into the town here, turn left. And I believe this is the bakery. Here's also the sell point for the eggs, which is something we've uh, not actually bothered with during this series, the eggs. But we're back in there. Unload that. See how much we get. So we've got, uh, what, £37,331 for that load there. I'm just going to double check on the map, make sure that was the actual bakery. Uh, zoom out, yes it was. That's fine. So we'll head back to the yard. Like I said, it's been uh, a good series this has. It has gave us uh, a few uh, up and down moments. We've had moments where we've uh, uh, got everything right and the money's come flowing in. We've had a good de uh, great demands, etc. We've also had moments of uh, puzzle puzzlement and why things wasn't working or why things wasn't growing so uh, yeah we've experienced sort of bits and pieces on this map we've done new things we've uh, ploughed fields out from wasteland destroying bushes etc but all in all I think it's been quite a good series like I say let's have your feedback and your comments down below Here we are back at the yard once again. So next up is that wheat. We've got 81,000 litres, so we're going to fill the trailer completely this time.
Shunt impacts of Fords. There we go, 59,000 litres of wheat on now. We'll get that uh, cover closed up. We'll have a little look. Wheat, as we said, uh, the harbour is the second best price. We don't want to be taken up to the transport company once again. So we'll head off to the harbour. So I think what we'll do is we'll head right out of the farm along the main road, follow it round give us a different uh, view as to uh, the uh, map I think it's technically uh, the shorter route as well because the harbour's further along than what the town is essentially it's just to the left of us there of course it's a uh, great big hill that uh, you can't get over certainly not with a truck So here is the harbour up here, we're going to think we're turning in here. I think we've got two entrances, this one and the one at the front there. But uh, yeah, it's very nicely done. I believe this is the uh, cell point just here. I don't think it is because it won't let us sell. Oh, there we go, it's triggered it there now. I think the triggers are slightly uh, out on the map. I think they could do with some improvement. But uh, that's uh, minor adjustments from uh, Giants. So. That's that done. We got uh, 60,288 pounds for that load there. So we'll head back to the farm now. I think on our journey back, I think we will end the episode there. Like I said, we are going to come back and do some more videos at some point within this series, I think. But uh, today is definitely the last for some time. We'll calculate the rest of the money based upon uh, the actual figures at the time. And then uh, we'll transfer all the money over to the new series. But uh, yeah, like I say, hopefully you have enjoyed the series. Hopefully it's been uh, educational as well as fun. But uh, yeah, I think the uh, map itself is very nicely decorated. It's uh, been quite enjoyable to play. But uh, yeah, now that we're back here, I think... Uh, that is going to be it. We'll pull up on the driveway today with the lorry. Shut that off there. So there we go. So that is going to be it for today. Hopefully you have enjoyed. If you have, remember to drop us a like. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you are new, of course. But yeah, thank you very much for watching this series. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. And... Uh, we shall see you in the next series. Thanks for watching and bye for now.